There. That's it. That's him. What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. All right, folks. Mr. Warmack, back in the building as usual. As you can see, I got my pen because I moved. What I did is I used to do my, uh, my fine, exquisite videos here, as you can tell. Pro quality. But, uh... I used to do my videos in a uh, extra, uh, excuse me, extra room we had here. What I did is I brought it to my my workstation area because I got my computer here. Like you can't see it, but I'm sitting actually sitting down. With my computer's here. I look at stuff, and I got my notebook here. That's why you had the pen. My, I had the pen in my hand. And I write stuff down, and I, and sometimes I look, I look at your little nasty grams you send me in the emails, and I I, I talk about that too, but. Today we're going to talk about a topic that you guys should be real concerned about. There's going to be no immigration bill as as much as much as we want one in 2004, unless a miracle happens. There's no, unless unless and as I go on, I'll show you. I'll tell you how there there will be one. But as far as as of right now, there's no immigration bill about to be done. Let's put this. It might get done December 31st or something. But as far as we know, ain't no immigration bill about to be done this year and let me go in. The hopes of passing the immigration bill were dashed away when House Speaker Boehner, which I have to give credit, when I nailed him in that video about he needs to suck it up, he's been sucking it up lately, so I do give you credit, Boehner. Good job for a minute. Boehner said he didn't expect the bill to be passed this year. He also blamed Obama for the inability of the House to move forward. Now, see, this is the only problem I have. He's talking about blaming this, that, third. He's placing blame on the wrong, first of all, he's placing blame on the wrong doorstep. It's not Obama that's stopping the House to move forward. He knows who it is, but he can't call them out on it because that would go against his party. It's those Tea Party fucking wackos that are making, that are making, that you can't do anything with. And, and the bad part about it is they, 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 they don't want to deal with nothing. It's either their way or hell. And right now, folks, we're getting hell. You know, the skepticism isn't, you know, unfounded. Hell, there's three, there's three million documented, what, what was that one report? Three million undocumented immigrants were allowed to apply for citizenship, yet, you know, there's no, there's no promise of a secure border. That's when the Republicans saying they want a secure border. Hell, let me put it to you this way. There, Ronald Reagan did the same thing, but this is why I say Obama's policies or similar to Ronald Reagan, and if people have a problem with Obama and like love Ronald Reagan, it's not because you know the policies. It's because they're on some other bullshit. Ronald Reagan went through the same fucking thing. Ronald Reagan was letting all these illegal immigrants in the country, trying to get them, you know, on the rolls so they vote for him. It's common sense. Ronald Reagan promised a secure border. It's not secure, folks. But at the same time, you have these people here. Oh, I love Reagan to death. Obama's a commie. Well, Reagan was also accused of being a communist. See, I like how you re you revisionist rewrite history. You forget all these little details about this and about that about Ronald Reagan. A side note, and I know I'm just going off topic. I know I'm talking about immigration bill, but when they talk about Obama tax this, that, and the fifth, Ronald Reagan raised eleven. I mean, raised taxes on the middle class eleven times through the series of stealth taxes and through your retirement programs. Don't blame me, look that up. So while, while Obama has, you know, gave us that big tax in Obamacare, Reagan hit us 11 times through a series of stealth taxes. But yet, Ronald Reagan's a god. Like I said, you're on some other shit. Now back to immigration. You have all these undocumented immigrants. And uh, I think it sounds like no deal can be reached because they want a secure border but Obama's being slick because votes coming up. He, they, Democrats don't want to discuss this because both sides lose when the deal gets struck. Because then you're going to have the, the, and I don't know how you get this, you're going to have the Hispanics in this country or the Africans in this country and whatever else is in this country. They're going to raise their little, hey, man, why don't you let my cousin from Ecuador in? He, he's, under, he's, he's undocumented, but he went to school like 20 times. I'm like, look, 
me personally, if you can come to this country and you follow the rules of the road, give them, give them your citizenship. I got no problem with that. The problem lies when you got people who are doing it the right way. You shit upon what they're doing by you coming in here and this oh, okie doke and you can automatically bang, you get that. This is the only country that rewards criminals. I mean, I know a lot of countries reward them. But we do it overt. We do it overtly. We do it in, in the public, where they you know these are legal, but you can't do nothing about them. Look, if I was somebody in prison, I'd I'd start you know filing lawsuits on the government saying you're picking and choosing which criminals to prosecute. That's discrimination. But that's just me, folks. So in essence, we're not going to have an immigration bill done. The Democrats are going to get their way. The Republicans are going to lose board, lose seats, and the Tea Party is just going to fuck everybody else again. I'm out. Peace. There. That's it. That's him.